Welcome back to the New Mexico Lobos. Today we play BYU in a huge showdown in the Big 12 West. But first, let's look at Croton, and then we will look at the game. Uh, we missed the Fresno State game. Uh, so this is uh, the guy at the top of our board right now, Brenton Smith. Uh, but you look at our commits, a bunch of, bunch of like mid-60s guys. These are the guys I like, three, four stars that are mid-60s that can just improve, especially with the roster we have now, which is so young. Uh, you know, these guys that probably aren't going to be playing until they're juniors and seniors, so it's okay to get them a little worse. Uh, you know, they'll have three, maybe even four years uh, if they get redshirted to improve, and they'll be good by the time by the time they play. This is my worst guy, but he's still not bad, and he's from New Mexico. I felt like I should get him. Um, Patterson, Douglas, I needed to get the guy from New Mexico, actually, to uh, just keep make sure it's still a pipeline state. But it's a pretty good class. We should have a few more guys coming in, uh, probably eight or nine of these guys that haven't quite committed yet. He looks like we're in good shape there. And we have a couple soft commits, uh, one from this 70-rated receiver from Texas who's 6'5", 208, uh, and is already pretty fast, um, 89 speed already. So I'm, I'm very excited about this guy. Catching 72, 67 catching traffic, which is really as good as most of the receivers I have. So decent recruiting so far. I'm excited about Derek Mills for sure. Brenton Smith, we'll see. We're kind of in a dogfight right now with Virginia Tech and Nebraska. And then uh, Will Clark is quite good as well from Texas. And then I got this four-star quarterback who I'm excited about. Hopefully he'll battle with Williams, the guy we're redshirting down the line. There you have it. Let's check out the Fresno State game you missed. All right, yet again, it came down to the wire. We are not playing particularly well, but we are pulling games out. Last second field goal winner. Uh, we came from seven down in the fourth quarter and, and got the win. It wasn't pretty. We stuck with the run, even though it wasn't super effective, but 34 for 153. Cooper had a pretty good game. Uh, the two picks, only one was my fault. And then Massey fumbled. Massey had by far the worst game of his career. We'll check it out in a sec. But one of the picks was my fault. One was definitely his fault. And the red zone threw it about four yards behind the guy uh, for a touchdown. Should have wrapped this game up far earlier. The defense played well again. But we're not really playing great teams right now. Um, yeah, Jones was okay. Not, not terrific. He made a few bad throws that weren't on me. Cooper played very well. 25 for 152. It's been what I've wanting, I've been wanting to see from him all year. Finally came through. Uh, had the 35-yard touchdown run, so he was quite good. Receiving-wise, Massey, yes, he had 8 for 124. He was great there, but a fumble and five drops. He was dropping everything, but I continued to go back to him, and in the fourth quarter, he didn't drop any. Did not drop any. And, uh, and and won the game for us down the stretch. White was also terrific. Uh, both my receivers are great. We didn't really f get McIntyre into this game, and I want to get him in a little bit more going forward, the speedster. So we'll do that. Let's look at the conference standings, and then we'll get to the game. So this is where we're at right now. We're top of the division, tied with Boise, but we obviously beat them. So we have a game. Uh, we have the tiebreaker there. So, uh, Boise or BYU rather just lost to Colorado State last week uh, by one on the road. Tough loss for them. Uh, so they drop back with two losses. We still have to play San Diego State and UNLV. UNLV is not as bad this year. They won a few games, so that that's not a gimme. And certainly the San Diego State game is not a gimme either. It's on the road, so. It's going to be tough down the stretch here. Obviously, if we win out, we're Big 12 West champs, 10 wins, and we go to the Big 12 championship. If we lose any of these, uh, it's obviously going to come down to tiebreakers, and we'll see where it shakes out. It's very close right now, and, uh, you know, uh, really anyone from any of these four teams could win it, and it's not impossible for Colorado State to if, if some really wacky stuff happens. Um, and in the Big 12 East... It looks like it's going to be TCU, UCF, maybe SMU can get up there. So one of these guys should be a fun finish to the season. Let's get to the BYU game in Provo. Should be a barn burner. Welcome to Provo, Utah for a pivotal division matchup here in the Big 12 West. Should be a fun one here. Packed 
back in the Rocky Mountains of Utah. New Mexico, BYU, New Mexico will kick off first, and the Cougars will come out from their own 25. An early first down, and now inside New Mexico territory, an early touchdown for the Cougars. Early touchdown for the Cougs. And New Mexico comes out now with the ball, trailing by seven early on. White pants, silver helmets with the white jerseys. Classy as ever for the Lobos. Five on first down. It's a good, good start. Again, Cooper was much better last game than he has been. Um, hopefully he can continue that going forward. We still struggle blocking, but we, we got timely runs, which was the key. Uh, you know, perfect, perfect timing on a lot of those runs, especially late in the game, which was real nice. So... Hopefully we'll get some more of that, but maybe some better blocking also early in the game could be nice. Simmons. Mm. You should be able to catch that and turn up real fast and get that first down. Third and one. We've struggled on these the last couple games. Um, yeah, we just... I'm not sure what it is, but... He got it. He got it. Cooper's got a little more strength than Parrish. That's... It, they're a nice combo, really. Um, Parrish with the speed coming in as a change of pace. And then you've got uh, Cooper has a little bit more strength and he's able to, to put a little bit more pressure on DBs trying to make tackles downfield, which I, I like that a lot. So, uh, Nobody there. Probably shouldn't have rolled out, but I've been so gun shy because my we've been so bad at pass blocking recently that I just don't trust them. There's Simmons. There's Simmons. First down. First down out near midfield. Second first down of the drive. Great strike from Jones, and it is James Simmons, the junior, the veteran. Why is my fullback not picking that guy up? Why is my fullback not picking up the only guy outside the tackle? That's that's all he has to do, and we're off and running there in a big way. We're going to run it here. Favorable box. Favorable box. Parrish, you got to get up, but 65. Dude, my left guard, son, you have to get that block. You have got to get that block. There's no, I mean, you get that block, we have a first down. Now it's third and ten. That's just, that's the difference between winning and losing. The difference between living and dying, right? That was my perfect Al Pacino impression. You're welcome. It's free of charge. Oh, man, I thought he was going to catch that. It was a stupid throw. They ended up both going with him, which surprised me, but he almost caught that. Come on, D. There we go. There we go. Got the stop. Took a sec, but we got it. I feel like the Demons going to have a rougher game today than they've been having. We have got to score some points. We've scored... 30 points over the last two games combined, so, I mean, it's got to be significantly better today. I'm talking I'm talking 30 alone in this game, probably, if we're going to have a real chance to win, so. Got to get it going. Almost the end of the first quarter already, and obviously no points on the board, so. Simmons, his third catch in the early going. Five more there for him. flanker drive this wheel is open sometimes that R1, that McIntyre wheel oh I thought it was a wheel oh did I choose the wrong play crap on a cracker alright Massey there's a first down I'm not sure why he went so wide with that route but it worked out another thousand yard season for Massey just racking it up 
easily going to become the greatest receiver in New Mexico history, I believe. Although it didn't improve that much last year um, in terms of his rating, which was disappointing. So, um, mm, mm, bad throw. Stupid throw, stupid throw, stupid throw. Man, I keep forgetting to change that quarterback's face mask. That is really irritating to me. That just must be a glitch in the game where the quarterback has like a, a running back face mask. I hate that. Why are we not blocking the play side linebacker? Why are we not blocking the play side linebacker? <sighs> Third and ten. Go smash. We'll go that side though. We got white over here. I can't run it. I'd like to with that box, but. I mean, we got to be able to block that. He, oh my goodness. Oh. Here they go. Here they go. Oh, good job, defense. Oh, they kicked a long field goal. Morons. All right, D. D is coming through for us. We really, really need to get something going on offense. Six minutes left in the second quarter. Still nothing to show for our efforts, and still nothing. He just doesn't have that burst, does he? Linebackers are tracking him down, and he can't outrun them. He doesn't have a burst right away. In the open field, he can outrun guys. Um, but right out of the gates, he, he really struggles. That's a good run, though. Third and inches. Let's go hurry up, actually. See if we can't catch him napping. Other way, other way. No, I want to flip it. There you go. Unbelievable he let him spin off. We gotta go. We gotta go. That's just terrible blocking. Going with the stick here. Fourth and two. Simmons, fourth catch of the day. There's a first down. Sometimes you got to be aggressive on the road. I like to be a little bit more conservative at home uh, because I know my defense is going to play better. But against a good team on the road, sometimes you got to take a few chances. Uh, and I thought that was the proper time to do so. Again, a favorable box. Favorable box, and that's what happens. 12 for Parrish up the middle. And it's first down. Throw it here and just keep mixing it up. I send them straight down the middle. Sometimes when they fade off like that, it ends up being cover two. White with a great catch. Man, he has been catching everything lately. Massey's had a lot of drops, but White has been really, really terrific catching the football. We're right when we've needed it, as Massey's kind of kind of let us down a bit over the past three or four games. He's still had great games, don't get me wrong, and I love him, but um, but he has been worse, certainly. Certainly, in terms of catching the football. So, Looks like uh, Parrish is hurt. That's no good. Yeah, we'll go tight end angle. Another throw on first down here. For that corner for Massey, he might be open if I have time. Way underthrown. That has to be to the pylon. Unbelievable. He's not going to score, is he? That has to be to the pylon, Mark! That's just... It's got to be way more outside. That's irritating. A great drive, too. Oh, defense. Oh, defense. Oh, defense. I don't blame you. We've been terrible, but mm, we're in trouble. We are in trouble. We're having so much trouble moving the ball, and then I'm throwing picks when we get down there, too, and it's just not ideal. Good catch, McIntyre. 
Second and inches. Come on, hurry up. Why do they take so long? We need points this drive. Almost, I mean, it's almost a must. It just took him, it just took him a year to get off that coverage. Look at that. Yeah. Good job, defense. Good job, defense. But this one feels, feels almost over already. Oh my goodness, they are better than us. But they're not that much better than us statistically, which is irritating, or ratings-wise, you know what I mean. He dropped it. He dropped it. I started running too early, but... Oh, not our day, boys. Not our day. We need three. I know we only got 17 seconds, but we got three timeouts. We need three points right here. They're going to call a timeout. Unbelievable. Uh, there wasn't anybody open. Oh, man. Man. This is just a garbage fire right now. McIntyre had a touchdown, but we can't block a three-man rush. He had a touchdown. But we cannot block a three-man rush. Did we fumble on the kickoff? Unbelievable. Unbelievable. It... It has all gone sideways, boys. It has all gone sideways. All the bad stuff we've been doing the last few games, but surviving is finally coming to a head here, and it's it's ugly. There's a catch from Fitzpatrick. Got him in. It's his first action of the day. And a beautiful catch over the top. And... Six minutes left, so this thing ain't over. Six minutes left in the third quarter, so obviously it ain't over. But need stuff in a hurry. There's Fitzpatrick. I'm sure that's a hold. I'm sure that's a hold. <laughs> Unbelievable. Come on, man. Come on. We just, we can't catch a break, man. Yell at him. Yell at him, me. Theoretically, me. Goodness. Goodness, goodness, goodness. Good catch, Simmons. He's having a heck of a game. He's having a heck of a game. He had our, you know, you saw that middle of the year when he was struggling a bit, but, but he's been our best player today, in my opinion. Catching everything. And another for first down. We're going to hurry up. We're going to hurry up if they would go. Flanker drive. Here we go. Here we go. Need a touchdown. Probably will go for two because we may need points later regardless. Massey, all right. All right. We're moving it. We're moving it. Keep it up. Keep it up. Let's go. Hurry up. Hurry up. Linker dagger. I really like Simmons on these little short streaks here. No, that's not what I meant. Good catch though. I meant to throw a triangle on the on the drag, but nope. It went out wide and I tried to go hurry up, but they showed the replay, and so I couldn't. First and goal at the five. Still five minutes to go in the third quarter. This thing is not over. This thing is not over. Dropped it. Dropped it. He's a tight end. He shouldn't be dropping that. He should not be dropping that. All right, we're going to go with my favorite play, flood right. <sighs> we're just not going to block today, are we? i got to get better offensive linemen. I need to go somewhere where I can actually recruit offensive linemen, huh? Wouldn't you say that's probably the key?
Simmons. Oh, it's Presley. Presley in there. Simmons, I guess, was a little tired. Presley makes the catch. And we are in business. First touchdown of the game. 24-6 will go for two here. Because even 27-8 is much better than 27-7. Even if the, you know they get another field goal or whatever, obviously. So there it is. There it is. There it is. 24-8. Come on, boys. Come on. Let's go, defense. Let's go, defense. We still got a chance in this game. We need stops, though. We need stops. We need stops. We need stops. They got the field goal. Not the worst. Really wish we could have stopped them, but beggars can't be choosers. 27-8. Still three-possession game, and a field goal can be one of those possessions. So this ain't the end of the world. It's the end of the world. Yeah, it's the end of the world because Massey cannot catch a ball recently. Massey cannot catch a ball recently. I mean, he just he just handed that to him. They they always review these, but they never challenge it, even though it's clear that they grabbed it off the <laughs> off the deck. Oh, White's out for two weeks. That's great. Yeah, see that clearly hit the ground, but they never say it did. I mean, he yeah he clearly picked it off the ground. <laughs> yeah. Clearly, but they never say it. They do. Sadly. Oh, that's the end of our hopes there, boys, I think. I'm not sure. I'm not sure we can overcome a 25-point deficit with 9 minutes and 33 seconds to go. I guess it's possible, but I don't really see how. Good move by Cooper there. Let's just keep it up. If y'all would hurry up like I'm telling you to. That was interference. It was interference. It was interference. Or holding before the throw. He's hold watch. Right there, he didn't let him out of his break. He's holding him. He didn't let him out of his break, man. He was going to be wide open. And he missed that field goal. It's embarrassing. I guess I shouldn't be... I shouldn't be one to speak. I get that. 33-8. to eight. That was that was a garbage call. They call holding on us like every fourth play some games, but can't call that on them. Massey finally caught one. Go, 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 go. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. The speedster. The speedster. Down inside the 10 with 58 to go in the third quarter. We are still kicking. We are still kicking. Never say die attitude from this low bow team. Love it. A little mesh. Ah, oh, I should have hit the other guy on the drag. I should have hit the other drag. That was stupid of me. That was stupid of me. I got. Ah, that was stupid. That was stupid. Massey. Massey, 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 Massey. Oh, the flood. Dropped it. Dropped it. He didn't continue his route. If he keeps going across the back of the end zone, he never runs into anybody. There's a must score here. Fourth and goal. If we have any chance in this game, it has to come right now. Let's 
It's over. It's over. I'll do one more drive unless they score here. If they score here, we will uh we'll just sim the rest. Oh, it's our ball. Go one more drive. If we can score quickly, uh, I'll keep going. But if, if if we don't score, I think we'll just call it a day. Not our day here in Provo, is it, boys? We knew it'd be tough on the road against a good team, a ranked team uh, that had just lost. Was probably pretty upset with how they lost to Colorado State on the road, and just couldn't get it done. Just couldn't get it done. It is what it is. We'll be all right. Another big game next week, though. Still a chance to be Big 12 champs. Not if we don't block anybody, though. Yeah, how about you apologize to him for getting him just killed all season long? Moron. Ness Jones. He got hit again. Of course he did, because we cannot block a soul. I guess I should go for it. I guess I'll go for it. Why not? Now well, let's do that. Let's flip it. I might just throw a jump ball to Massey here. That worked. All right. All right, well, I'm glad we went for it. That was the, just a genius decision. Didn't even hesitate. Didn't hesitate a bit. Five forty-seven left. We need four scores. I'm not gonna make an Abraham Lincoln joke. Uh, sometimes you just gotta throw it up for one of your best players and pray, especially when you're down 25. I think that'll be it. I don't see the point in continuing this. I'm just gonna go sim to the end and see how bad the damage is. Hey, we scored. We got a field goal. 43-15 final. Not our day in Provo, boys. Not our best showing, was it? Very, very disappointing indeed, but still a chance at a division title. Uh, we, we need BYU to lose in theory. I'm not really sure how it's all going to work. I think because they're ranked highest, they'll probably end up there if it's like a four-way tie or whatever, but we'll see. Um, regardless, we're 7-3, and three, two winnable games left. We can get to nine wins, and then with a bowl, get to ten wins, which is our goal. Our three goals, obviously, were bowl, ten wins, Big 12 championship. Uh, Big 12 championship is looking unlikely, but the others very much, very much possible. So join us next time we will play San Diego State. Looking to go 8-3 and three on the season and remain in the Big 12 title hunt. Thank you for watching. Sorry for the loss. Take it easy.